Hello and welcome to this 10 part short series on AI agents. Today is the very first video and we're diving into a little introduction to what AI agents are. I'm Femke, I've been working in the AI space for the past couple of years now and one of the most hot topics right now are AI agents. If you follow AI developments, you've probably heard the term AI agents being thrown around lately. And there's a good reason for that, but there's something interesting. They're not exactly new. In fact, AI agents themselves have been around for quite a while, though they didn't use today's generative large language models. What's new is how incredibly capable they've become. So what is an AI agent? Let's first understand what is not an AI agent. Simple one-shot prompting. When you use a chatbot like ChatGPT, you ask, it answers. End of story. But this has some obvious limitations. Sometimes the answers can be a little bit fake, maybe not quite what you were looking for. This is a linear process. You ask, it answers, and that's it. No way to improve the results. AI agents are different. They're more like problem solvers who won't give up until until they're right. And they will try different approaches, learn from what works and what doesn't work, and keep on going until they've achieved what you asked for. So at its core, an AI agent is a semi or fully autonomous system that uses a large language model as its brain for critical decision making and solving complex tasks. So think of them as intelligent decision making engines that only need your initial requests. They use various tools like web search engines, databases, and APIs and much more in their environment to complete the tasks, allowing you to step back while they work out the solutions. 